You know, I get truly and utterly sickened by some of the crap that people pull in this country and get away with it when they're sent to jail, either for a term that's far too lenient, they avoid jail, or they try and parole a lengthy sentence, and they go, oh, that's okay, mate, I'll let you out, no problem at all. Well, I was humbled to see in this case, justice was done, and a guy that was part of something very heinous indeed is right where he belongs and not going anywhere very soon. How to everybody, welcome back to the channel for a Monday. Hope you're doing all right. Uh, yeah, I'm not too bad. Let me know what you're up to in the comments below. As always, it's good to hear from you. Well, let's get straight to it, shall we? Have a look at this gentleman. And I use that term in the loosest sense possible. He's actually nowhere near a gentleman. His name is Abdul Ali. He's 38 years old now, and he's known as Eddie to his friends. Well, he's uh, in jail. He got sentenced to 26 years. And the reason is he headed up a ring uh, with five other people, which recruited young girls into the trade, should we call it. And they were plied with booze, food and money and uh, groomed into performing the trade. I'm using that word because I don't want the YouTube censors to pick up on me and I don't want to get bollocked for reporting to you truth. Now, he was jailed for his part in this and he's really, you know, all this happened between 2006 and 2009 and he recently tried to appeal his sentence and get himself out. Well, he was actually bailed in 2020, but was promptly returned to prison because he breached his bail conditions or his license. And back he went and he's literally just been uh, stuck inside again. I, as a father, I find this kind of uh, activity more abhorrent than anything else that I care to think of. It's disgusting, it's despicable. And I don't think people like this should see the light of day uh, for a long time, if not ever again. I don't know what you think about this, but I, the, the point is I am actually pleased that justice has been done uh, in that he will not be let out. I think this ring needs to be completely smashed to pieces if it hasn't been so already. And what really, really upsets me about all this is they're probably not the only ones. This is going on all over the place, isn't it? We know it. Uh, Rotherham and other places like that is despicable and all with our children what the hell has gone wrong with the world and I I hope that this action alone sends a very clear message out that this is unacceptable totally let me know what you think in the comments below uh, be interesting to read it's uh, a very horrible subject but needs mentioning 26 years and you're staying put to the loop.